Hey, y'all. Hey. Okay, so y'all know Elijah E. Cummins, mm -hmm. the ranking member of the House Committee yes. on Oversight and Government Reform, sent a set of 51 letters to the White House, mm. multiple federal agents, and other requests for compliance by January the 11th, 2019. Hmm. Now, keep in mind, you all, the Democrats are taking the House right. this January. Mm. But here's what they want to know. I don't think they take the House. Do they take the I House? I think they stole the House. You think they ahead. stole the House? Yes, ma'am. Okay. So ahead. this is the letters that they sent. Response to Hurricane in Puerto Rico and U.S. Virgin Islands. Mm -hmm. Immigrant child separation. Mm. Flint water crisis. Mm -hmm. And that Flint water crisis happened under Obama. Obama. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, 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 uh. Ebola, oh, payments, payments from, from foreign, foreign governments. governments. Security clearance, White House security clearance process, right. White House and cabinet member travel, EPA misconduct, Federal Records Act compliance, mm -hmm. whistleblower protection, okay, is what they want, and the, and, and the President Records Act compliance. These are documents relating to the use of personal email and messaging accounts mm -hmm. by non-career officials at the White House uh -huh. in violation of White House policy uh -huh. and the Presidential Records Act, uh -huh. okay? In case y'all don't know what that is. The Presidential Record Act prohibits every White House employees, including presidents and vice presidents, from creating or sending a record using a non-official electronic message account mm -hmm. unless the employees copy his or her mm -hmm. official email account or forwards a complete copy mm -hmm. to the official email account no later than 20 days after sending receiving the original email. But here's what I got Ooh. to say to all of this here. What you got to say? Where in the hell was Elijah Cummings? Yes. When Obama sent Iran $150 billion in cash. Where were you Because hands, if we take a thousand too much out of our bank account, uh -huh. the I... The R and the S is going to be notified. That's right. Where was your ass at, Elijah? Elijah. Where was you at? Uh -huh. Let me say it this way. Uh -huh. Where was you at, Elijah, uh -huh. when the water crisis of Flint happened? Where were you at? Uh -huh. that was Where was Obama? you at? Because that was done yeah. up under the Obama administration. administration. You say payments from foreign governments. Uh -huh. Well, what about the payments that were given to the Clinton Foundation uh -huh. for foreign government. Uh -huh. Why wasn't you investigating you? that? Yes. You want to talk about hurricane? A hurricane? What did you do for a hurricane victim? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. What did you do for him? That's uh -huh. right. yeah. You want to talk about child separation, uh -huh. Elijah? Uh -huh. Well, why don't you go back to up under the Obama administration That's right. when he had them wrapped in full uh -huh. living in cages? cages? Where was your ass That's at? It. Where was your tongue at uh -huh. talking about it? That's right. See, this is what I want y'all to see, Americans. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I want y'all to see the yes. games that they are about Multiple. to start playing. That's right. They're not going to be working for you. Yeah. They can care less about your health care. That's right. They can care less about you having more money in your pocket. That's right. They can care less about you trying to attain the American the dream. Because all they're trying to do is a, obtain a gotcha moment. That's right. If that's all they're, they're trying, trying to, to do. do. And not one piece of legislation was sent to the White House to sign that will benefit we, the American people. But you want to send some stupid some foolishness like, like this, this right here. And then you want to know why I'm always upset. Uh -huh. yep. Some of this stuff you may have to bleep out. Yeah. And then on top of that, let me go ahead and get this on off my chest. Uh-huh. Before I get into the new year. Uh -huh. Christopher Seals said he was secretly hired to help Hillary Clinton. That's what he said, you uh -huh. all. Listen, there was a defamation lawsuit by three Russian bankers. Christopher Steele is now on record testifying that he was hired specifically to help the DNC and Hillary Clinton find information to challenge the results of the 2016, 2016 election. election. But the fake news ain't talking about ain't that. Talking about ain't nobody that. talking about that right That's there. Right. That's right. Let me go ahead and read on. Uh -huh. Steele testified that he was hired specifically to help the DNC and Hillary Clinton find information to challenge the result of the 2016 election. That's right. Christopher Steele said that Perkins Cole Law Firm hired him to help Hillary Clinton challenge the results of the 2016 presidential election. Right. So it, it appears to me. It appears. Uh-huh. This is how I see it. Yes. That Hillary Clinton and her camp was already colluding. They was already Before colluding. this thing got started. Just in case. Yes. 
I lose. How do I challenge That's this? That's right. And guess who told it? Mm -hmm. Christopher Steele. Yes. So while Mr. Steele was being interrogated, uh -huh. here's what he said. Here's what he said. Fusion immediate client was law firm's Perkins Cole. That's right. It engaged Fusion to obtain information necessary for Perkins Cole LLP to provide legal advice on the potential impact mm -hmm. of Russia involvement on the legal fidelity of the outcome of the 2016 U.S. presidential election. election. That's right. Where in the heck is Bob or uh, 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 Mueller? Where, where you at, Mueller? Where in the heck is Mueller? That's right. Where you at? Where you uh -huh. at? Yeah, uh-huh. Based on that advice, parties such as the Democrat National Committee DNC. And, and HFAAC, Inc., also known as Hillary for America, uh -huh. could consider steps that would be legally entitled to take to challenge the validity of the outcome of that election. That's right. So it seems like what the DNC did mm -hmm. was pay Perkins Law Firm, uh -huh. who paid Christopher Steele, uh -huh. to create a report that yeah. can be used if election did not go Hillary's way. That's right. So basically, Hillary's campaign challenged the election legitimacy before Trump won the election. Right. Did she help fund a coup. Did she help fund it? That's right. Because now, where is Mueller on this? Cipher. Remember, if you remember in one of our last chit chat, mm -hmm. we talked about how this money mm -hmm. is being ciphered through the law firm of Perkins. Mm -hmm. Okay, and so did did Hillary Clinton? Did did she collude? Uh, have any type of interference? Right. In the election, mm. by the way she did things. Mm. Wait a minute, girl. Mm. The defamation concerns a false story allegedly spread by Fusion GPS uh -huh. that the Trump team had been found in to be in communication with the Russian Alpha Bank. Mm -hmm. When it began appearing on social media in 2016, some online sloth looked out looked at the server's IP address That's right. and other data. Mm -hmm. They traced the server to a location outside of Philadelphia that spewed marketing spam. Mm -hmm. A Trump organization official told the Washington Times last year that some of the spam went to Alpha Bank employees who perhaps stayed in Trump hotels. Mm -hmm. That's how Alpha turned up in some emails. Right. The New York Times investigated and said the FBI basically came to the same conclusion. Mm -hmm. But Fusion tried to put the fake story of Bruce Orr and the Justice to Department. Wait a minute. But Fusion tried to push the fake story to Bruce Orr uh -huh. and the Justice Department in any event. Uh huh. Uh huh. Yeah. Uh huh. The FBI gave everybody on Hillary's side immunity in, in exchange, exchange for nothing. For nothing. Uh huh. Yeah. That's right. Uh -huh. And then, girl, mm -hmm. we, so we were in what New York? What? No, no, no. We were in D.C. when DC. this broke. D.C. About now they're trying to say Russia influenced blacks. From voting for Hillary. No, Hillary influenced us That's to not right. to vote for her. That's because right. she is crooked. Yes. She is a crook. Yes. She took and she tried to demean. She dispersed. She tried to paint President Donald J. Trump. He was then the businessman yep. as a racist. racist. She, did she did that. She put out all of yep. these damnable commercials yep. against the president. That's right. And because of that, yep. we was influenced not to vote for uh -huh. her. And we didn't. That's Life's right. a and we didn't vote, vote for, for one. one. That's right. That's right. And she was also the same b mm -hmm. that started this birthday thing. That's right. Against Obama. She started that birthday thing, you all, when Obama was running back in 2007. Yep. See, because she didn't want Obama to win. To win. She That's didn't right. want him to win. This is what she and, was running against yeah, Obama. And she tried to make up like the man was a monster. Uh -huh. And this and that. And that he she tried to, to That's right. States. She tried to put that in the minds yeah, of the American right. people. But the fake news, all of them dismissed that. Uh -huh. uh, and they want to blame President Trump for that. Uh -huh. But no, you can blame uh, Crooked, Crooked Hillary. She started that. That's right. She started that. That's right. Uh -huh. So listen, you all, we're just giving you a little author. Uh -huh. The show snack. That's right. Uh -huh. Yeah, after know. the show snack. Yes. A snackable, a snackable to snack on That's to right. the first of the year to see how all of this is going to go down. That's right. Okay? Listen, we was just coming to give y'all the 211. We call it the 211 because it's two of us. And we're the ones giving it to you. So in the meantime, in between time, next time, hopefully we'll give you another after show snackable. Bye-bye, everybody. Bye.